Many people ask me, how the heck did you get that into iMovie? Well, there's always a trick to it, but uh, trust me, you can get it in. Um, might cost you a little money, but uh, you can get it. Uh, the first thing is, don't use this QuickTime. Use this QuickTime, the old, the old QuickTime Player 7. You can still download it from Apple. Um, depending on what you're pulling, you also need the MPEG-2 playback component. Um, this is another thing I suggest is this has so many codecs in it, um, you know, a lot of the DivX and, and other, you know, off codecs. Uh, if you're pulling a lot of Windows media, and this is uh, free to play, uh, but, um, you know, I, I've used the Studio Pro to, to export, you know, high def Windows videos and and people people are impressed with them how how clear it is i think it does a better job than than the windows tool does uh this is another godsend is the um mpeg stream clip again this relies on the 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 quicktime mpeg 2 component being there so and also with this one if you get the beta you can actually rip the uh, flash want flash videos from YouTube and things of that nature uh, handbrake has uh, really improved a speed with this uh, new 64-bit version and um, you'll use that in conjunction with uh, video LAN to or VLC to uh, rip DVDs if you need to do that and if you're just just can't you know you've tried eight ways to sunday and still can't get it you can pretty much if you can see it on your screen you can you can rip it um and then you'll just have to use quicktime the good one to to export it out so uh it conforms with your imovie project uh sometimes there's a two-stage process uh i had this old techno video I was trying to get and I actually had to convert it uh, with handbrake and then convert it again with stream clip and then stream clip was actually able to export out a uh, you know MPEG 4 compatible version of the video that I could I could easily import into uh, iMovie so I was I was pleased to see that so you know just there, there's no cut and dry method, but, but there's always a way. Thanks for watching.